Style expert Amy Koch, the author of Bump It Up, is here this morning to help three of our moms and me deal with <laughs> pregnancy fashion headaches. Hi, Amy. Good morning. Hi, Maggie. You dubbed the term pregnantista. Absolutely. What is that? Fashionista plus pregnant chick equals pregnantista, <laughs> if they follow my tips, though. Only. Right. You have five <laughs> must-haves, right? Yes. What are they? The five must-haves, well, for, it's all about mix and match fertility fashion, I call it. So your must-haves <laughs> are your pregnancy jeans, a pencil skirt, which you can keep low or kind of take high, like leggings, exactly, a long Lycra black tank, and a multi tasking empire waist dress. So you can get away with this as your foundation and then dress it up. Absolutely. It's all about a formulaic approach to fashion. You've got your five basics and you mix and match so people don't realize you're wearing the same thing every day ah. and you transform five must-haves into 30 jaw-dropping ensembles. All right, let's talk about our first mom, Julie. She had a couple of frustrations. She thought that she could only wear black and that she had to say goodbye to, you know, jeans and pants. And this was kind of her look before. Like she said, comfort is key. Let's see what you've done with Julie. Well, Julie was a little funereal, and I say that with love because she really loved <laughs> black and she loved gray, and we bumped her up with a melange of color. She is our fierce and feminine woman. So we really combined, or I really combined, we've got an Oli on top from Belly Dance Maternity, and it's pink, it's got the ruching, but we kept it really tailored on top. She thought, you know, she's actually, she has varicose veins, very open about it. A lot of women suffer from this, so she really is limited in not wearing dresses. Uh -huh. We have in of the moment jeggings. So we've got a long lean jeggings, silhouette. Jeggings, jeans that are leggings? Yes, oh. and we saw them on the runway and we've got them on our Pregnantista. So we've got the long jeans and you always want to think verticality, verticality. So we've created verticality with the scarf, a pop of color, and because she's got the issue with the legs, we take the, the focal point up to her face with long neck grazing ah. earrings. So when you're pregnant, it's always long earrings and you, I say accessories have to match the bravado of your bump right. and I think we've done it here. I agree. You and can totally go out all day in that if you can walk in those shoes. Yeah, look that, at the that's shoes. That's not happening much. That's not yeah. happening. <laughs> the shoes are a little, <laughs> Turn a little, little the the shoes are a little on the fierce side, but these yeah, again, very, very of the moment spring fashion. It's a uh, peep toed right. uh, Djibouti booty. <laughs> well, do and like me, Julie, and just wear them two hours a day. Like exactly. Exactly. seven to nine is the and only again, time I look And I also with, her, with the bag, you really need a big bag. Yeah. We have to think about proportion and it balances her bump. And this is Linnea, I think it's Linnea Pella. Okay. And it's, she's a fierce female. We love her. Okay, All thank right. you, Julie. We got to get to Amy. Let's take a look at Amy's uh, before picture, so you can see. Oh, April's next. Okay, sorry. Let's bring April first. <laughs> got confused. April was the fashionista of the group. You saw her in the piece, but she hated all maternity clothes, and she she really thought that she couldn't be glam while pregnant. But as we see. Absolutely, April. You can still be glam. April is my glamour a go go look. She is so hot. She is wearing a goddess dress by More of Me Maternity, which is a new designer I just found out about. And what I like about it is she has not abandoned or forfeited her fashion sense at all. What I did with her is we kept her totally in style by this bold, bold color. The goddess dress is, you know, she's channeling Heidi Klum meets the Supremes in the pregnant form, of totally. course. Totally. And I Klum. added an empire waist. A lot of women don't know this, but with an with a really a tons of material, you empire waist it, create the illusion of a waist, and again, taking the focal point up to the face with the long earrings, an oversized um, clutch bag, and she's got va va voom gold I shoes. Love her and shoes. so she has got this hot look. She's created verticality, and again, she's using accessories as tools. Very nice. Yeah. Thank you, April. You look beautiful, and I love you know accentuating the belly because you only have this belly for it's a couple of months. It's actually true. Also, life, the right? hemline. We should talk about that. The hemline has to be short because okay. we're all short people here. Oh, there you go. Short. Right, Let's talk about Miss Amy, who had a problem with her arms, and so she would always hide them uh, with these uh, big sweaters and shirts. What did you do for Amy? Now, first of all, Amy is really pale. One of my big tips is the uh, the faux glow. <laughs> She's like, thanks Nobody a lot. has the prego glow naturally. It's an urban myth, so I use bronzer. And one of my favorite products is Lancome. We slathered her in bronzer, and again, I say it with love. Her look is short stuff. She's five foot two. She wants like to me. look taller. Exactly. Um, a little. She's always in flat. So what I did is she has she is a long lean baby making machine this is her going this is called um, peppy office prego she's going to the office wearing a nappies top one of my must-have long lycra um, tops a maternity skirt and we over it we have a DKNY cozy in the poppiest color she's so it's spray adorable. very spray so she looks five seven I think five yeah. eight maybe yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and she's got a scarf again adding the verticality if you hold up your wrist I put a couple of vintage bracelets on her a dash of flash goes a long way when you're wearing the same 
same thing every day. All right. And I gave her the Nicole Richie effect with the long layered necklaces. Again, when you're short, you want to create verticality. It's all about the long layered necklaces, no chokers. Thank you, Amy. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. I think we should, like, a la Sex in the City, go out and do something. <laughs> Sweet, right? Yeah. Maybe we will. Maybe no we'll, martinis. Maybe we'll change into, no our, martinis into our flats. No, <laughs> no Cosmos. A lot happens early on The Early Show, weekday mornings on CBS.